test, 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 test. Y'all know anytime we start a video at the gym, that means we got some shit going on. And we just happen to be at the gym at the beginning of the video. So welcome to this week's vlog. We already at Alpha Land. We got shoulders and we got chest today. So we're about to knock this out and get on with the rest of the day. We got some special stuff planned, but we gotta wait. You gotta you gotta wait for that. Y'all gotta wait for that. But with that being said, let's get into the workout, man. Shoot a whole clip Firepower in this coalition We just turned the field into a demolition It was desolate, but I had premonition I was training for war every exhibition Every extra mission, every enemy listening Get off my dick, I got bad intentions Make it right every wrong And I'm back with a vengeance, I show you the ropes Peace in my town, I can show you the coast Up in the shots if they wanted to smoke If you know, then you know Suit it up, bitch, my whole team do the same Don't you forget who created the game Ready for war, I was born with grenades The trenches were so Let's see how you do under pressure. Yeah. Let's see how you do under pressure. Give them a name to remember. Okay, okay. Hey, let's see how you do under pressure. Yeah. Let's see how you do under pressure. A moment can live on forever. Okay, okay. Let's see how you do under pressure. Yeah. Let's see how you do under pressure. I'm surprised the camera's still up. Hey, we just finished for our ass. Let's finish for our workout. So. Let me catch y'all in the car because the camera's gonna die. I don't wanna get I don't want it to die while I'm still talking, so I'll see you in a second. Woo. I got all my batteries charging at the house, so that's why I only end up with one camera battery now when I get to the gym because I normally just leave them at the house and then I have them charged and I just pick one up and normally these last like a whole day, but this one had like half battery, so it didn't last the whole day. But we just finished our workout as y'all can see. Normally, um I've been starting to get out for eats after all of my workouts just because like being here because right now it's like 4 30 you know what i'm saying and if i was to like leave during like houston traffic right now i wouldn't, wouldn't get home till like 5 30 6 o'clock and like i've only eaten really once one and a half times today you know what i'm saying so i started getting out for eats just because you know i could eat something real quick especially now and they go run errands and i wouldn't be mad at myself if i haven't eaten or nothing like that so i ordered grilled chicken sandwich with the sweet potato fries and i literally get that every single time and that's kind of what i've been doing not every day but like majority of days where i feel like i got something to do after the gym i normally will eat that just so i'm not like pushing meals back throughout the rest of the day but i told you on the last video if y'all was around y'all seen the valentine's day proposal and everything that i said i had some things coming for crane and for valentine's day and some things came in today but i also got to go pick something up today so i'm about to take out through that entire process show y'all what we got going on so y'all can see you know what i'm saying the in depth because i told y'all y'all on the youtube y'all getting exclusive content because certain things like this i don't want to put on like tiktok and instagram things like that i want to just show y'all like my life on youtube in full effect you feel me so like that's why sometimes i just be like if y'all on the youtube side like if y'all tapped in over here y'all gonna see a lot more than you do like short form rods because now i can take y'all throughout my entire day and show y'all what we got going on rather than try to like make a little tiktok or be like come get this with me you know what i'm saying like nah i could just show y'all my entire day you feel me so just finish the workout i told you anytime we start the workout or start the video at the gym it means we got some stuff going on today and for this entire week so yeah man but take y'all to the store see tell y'all what we get and show y'all what we already got because I'm telling y'all it's gonna be really y'all gonna y'all gonna like it y'all gonna like it a lot I'm telling y'all y'all just don't tell Crane when y'all see the but by, by the time y'all see this year already gonna have it so it ain't really gonna matter but any if, I'm just wanna let y'all know if I tell y'all something on the YouTube side like if I bring something to y'all some like confidential shit just don't don't tell nobody like it's supposed to be secret you know what I'm saying that's why I'm putting it in the video so I like, just don't spill the beans I know last time y'all was like Crane uh, Chris said he take you to Hawaii like damn bro I spilled all the tea damn I wouldn't even surprise no more so like keep the shit under wraps keep the shit under wraps or, or if not i can't show nothing no more so like all y'all in the comments if y'all see people commenting shit or telling crazy shit y'all get on their ass that's what i'm saying y'all get on their ass but i'm gonna get this food now and i'm gonna take y'all show what we got going on today because it's gonna be it's gonna be a good surprise i'm telling you it's gonna be a good surprise as y'all can see, we just arrived at Johnny Dang to get Cranin's gift. I'm gonna go inside and show y'all what we get in her and I'll show y'all what I already got in the car because I have a jeweler. The guy that made this one right here, I have a jeweler and I had him make a piece 
for Crane it. And she has somebody here, and I've been talking to him and trying to get some stuff in the works. So I actually got something to pick up inside there as well. Sorry, I don't mind the you know radar to make sure the cops ain't here and everything. But yeah, y'all, I'm only showing this y'all. I'm only showing this to y'all for purposes of like showing y'all kind of you know what what comes from you know the success and everything that we have. And like honestly, like it's one of those things where I'm doing something nice for Crane, but like I show this to y'all just so I can show y'all like what I'm able to do being in this position. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of people you know sometimes see people you know doing things and doing these extravagant things. They think they trying to flex on everybody and y'all gotta know like that's never gonna be me you know what i'm saying i feel like y'all already know that though like y'all know me more than that to know that that's never going to be me so i always want to like throw this disclaimer in there because like when i show y'all things like this like i'm not never the type of person to try to flaunt nothing on to the people especially my supporters you know what i'm saying like i'm trying to do this to show y'all like what we've been able to accomplish together like what our hard work and everything has brought us and i feel like like even me saying this like i feel like i shouldn't even have to say that you know what i'm saying because y'all know i'm not the type of person but i just want to throw that in there so just so like when I start showing y'all things like this, it's not one of those things where y'all think I'm flexing, y'all think I'm, you know, becoming better than or because or y'all think I'm, you know, thinking I'm better than or anything like that. Like I don't I never want y'all to have any thoughts or anything about that. Cause even when it comes to that, bro, I, I like keep it a band, like <laughs> I do more for others than I do for myself, bro. And that's just because like I never like to like flaunt or spend money on myself, bro. Like I'm the type of person I always want to do stuff for other people. And that's why I see like no problem in like, you know, getting them kids tickets to the game. Like those are all my supporters. Those are our supporters. Like getting them tickets to the game. Like getting craning something for Valentine's Day. Like, you know, helping my bros out and everything like that when they need help and everything like that. It's just like I'm just that giving type of person where I always try to, you know, put out more for somebody else than I do for myself. And I just I don't know. It's one of those things like I just don't want y'all to think anything of me of that and i feel like i shouldn't even have to say that so i'm really just going on a rant for no reason because i just want to throw that out there because i know somebody in the comments gonna be like why are you always showing you spending all this money and why are you always showing like you sh like we don't want to see that blah 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 and it's like bro like I, I understand what you're saying but at the end of the day i'm showing you my life right i'm showing you my life and i'm showing you how we elevate and i'm showing y'all what we got going on because of you know what we've been able to do you know so yeah man i'm 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 rambling for no reason because y'all already know me by now. But with that being said, we finna go inside and I'm about to show y'all what we got hurt and I got to show y'all what we get right here once we get back in the car. But yeah, we about to go inside now. I think y'all gonna enjoy it. I think y'all gonna enjoy it. But this, yeah, y'all gonna like it. Let's just go inside, bro. You know, sometimes they be tripping off recording, so I'm gonna try to get as much as I can, but I don't want to put no camera, you know, in nobody's face. So y'all bear with me, all right? The goal is really one of these. It's coming real soon, but you know, y'all stay tuned for that. I don't know. Maybe it's time to, you know, upgrade the swole piece. Cause you know, I haven't had it for a minute. You know what I'm saying? Maybe it's time to, you know, look for something else. You know what I mean? But for right now, we ain't on the mission. We here for one thing. So let me not get sidetracked and get ahead of myself. You know what I'm saying? Oh, um, trying to know about this right here. Something like nothing crazy. You know what I'm saying? Cause it is, you know what I'm saying? It's early stages still. So nothing crazy, but some. It's some. It's some wrapping it up this is what i really want to look at because i want a nail bro hold on y'all can't see it i really want a nail like this one i've been waiting to get one in this size those and a van cleef but you know those are come in due time in due time like i said we here for one reason just like that bag secure I'm telling y'all come shout out my people bro i'm telling y'all we got good connections over there at, at johnny dan tapping with my boy lambo you know what i'm saying he'll get you right for sure but let me get in the car and i'll show you what we got so boom, just like that, we are back in the car. So let me show y'all what we got. It got a little dark outside, so excuse the darkness a little bit, but as y'all can see, nice Cartier ring is what we got her for Valentine's Day. You know what I'm saying? Came in the box and all, you know what I'm saying? Nice little Cartier ring and boom, just like that. We got her a little Cartier ring for Valentine's Day. Just because, you know, it's one of those things where it's like, it's a little, it's a little promise to her, you know, because I'll tell y'all just straight up. Let me not get too sappy out here. You know what I'm saying? That she she the one, bro. She's the one for sure. You know what I'm saying? So little things like this just kind of just show, you know, my appreciation for her and everything. So, you know, when I can do things, little things like this to try to make her feel special, I will, you know. But, yeah, with that being said, bro, we just got her a little something, something nice, you know, for, just for Valentine's Day. And, you know, just blessed to be able to be in a position to be able to do something like this. But like I told y'all before, that's not all because I got something hidden right here. You feel me? And this right here is from my jeweler, the same guy that got me the swole piece right here. This is what we got her. And it's not, it's not going to hit the same because it's not in the light. But as y'all can see, she's finally, finally getting a piece. Hold on, let me turn. Hopefully the, the light can help it out a little bit. But she's finally 
get in a piece. As y'all can see, we got her a little, a little two-tone crane and pendant. You know what I'm saying? I wanted it to be dainty because I didn't want it to be too much. I didn't want it to be something that's, you know, super huge dangling on her neck or anything like that. But I got her a little dainty crane and chain, you feel me? So she can wear in the gym. She been wanting something like that. She been trying to get into jewelry, you know what I'm saying? Rocking some little pieces here and there to help, you know, accentuate outfits and everything. But yeah, bro, like I said, I was just trying to get her some, some things that I, I feel like she would want. And as y'all can see, we got the nice little, hold on. The nice crane piece. Two tone silver flooded iced out. As y'all can see, it's gonna look different in the light. Obviously, it's dark out here. So, you know, it's, it, when I opened it this morning, that thing was definitely busting. So, as I said, yeah, it's, this is one of the things for sure. So, I, these are the two things that I got her for Valentine's Day. You feel what I'm saying? So, hey, Crane, if you ever end up watching this video, love you, baby. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, yeah, y'all, I'm, I'm, I'm planning on giving her these tomorrow for Valentine's Day when we go out to eat and everything. She don't think I got nothing planned, but y'all know me. Y'all know me better than that. You know what I'm saying? She don't think I got nothing planned, but I just decided, you know, let me go get a couple things for her. Y'all see, I, I'm checking my surroundings because, you know what I'm saying, I'm still sitting in this parking lot, and I really shouldn't be. You feel me? But, yeah, man. I just want to do something nice for her, you know what I'm saying? I just want to give y'all some little backstory and some insight about it, you know, as I get her things and everything. Now I got to hide it from her, you know, so I'm about to put it in the glove box <laughs> so she don't see nothing, you feel me? But yeah, man, I got her. And you know, my line number is two, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm the number two in my line, so you know, dude's got to always double it, you feel me? So I'm going to give her one, and I'm going to pop out with the second one. She ain't going to know what hit her, you feel me? <laughs> so I might get her reaction tomorrow when we out to, out to eat, but, you know, some things you always got to keep private as well. Like, I don't want to just be out here, you know, exposing all of our, you know, you know, like, cause at the end of the day, you know, you keep, you we got a public re relationship, but certain things you got to keep private too. You feel me? But I just want to show y'all what I got her. So when y'all see it on her, y'all know where that shit came from. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, with that being said, she just called me. She's trying to figure out where I'm at. I have my location, everything turned out. So she don't know where I am, but I'm heading back now. So, you know, when I get back to the crib, I don't know what we're going to get into for the rest of the day, but yeah, we about to be, be, just be chilling. But I wanted to show y'all what we got. You know what I'm saying? So if y'all ever in Houston, shot with my man's Johnny Dang, you feel me? Or if you ever want to know where I got my piece or the craning piece from, my dog, Jacob Martin Jewelers down in Louisiana. You feel what I'm saying? So those are my two people that I always work with when I, when I want to get stuff done, you know, but I ain't gonna lie. I feel happy. Like I, re I feel really good doing something like this. Like I, I, I really feel like really good just being able to do something like this for her, you know, but yeah, with that being said, I'm rambling too much. I need to get up out of here because I'm not going to get caught lacking in this parking lot. You know what I'm saying? So I say I want to get to the crib <laughs> later that same evening. Y'all, so we made it home. So I just want to show y'all the pieces real quick. It keep going out of focus, but as y'all can see, you got the craning right there in the two-tone white and yellow gold, but I want to put the flash on it real quick so y'all can really see, you know what I'm saying, what it's hidden for. I know the camera not focusing, but that thing is definitely hitting. Oh my gosh. Then, of course, I obviously wanted to show y'all the ring as well. You see what I'm saying? Little nice ring in there. Hold on, let me put the flash on it too. It got a little fingerprints on there because I've been messing around with it, and I ain't gonna lie. But as y'all can see, Cartier in the box. Yeah, man. I think she's gonna I think she's gonna be really happy. I think she's gonna be really happy with these. But I'm out here whispering right now because she in the crib right now. And I'm not trying to make sure she don't hear me. <laughs> so I'm out here in the car being quiet. Oh my gosh, the lights just turned off. I'm out here in the car being quiet. <laughs> out here over here being secretive and stuff. But I just want to get a little close up of the other pieces before you know we go inside and everything. But yeah, that's gonna be it for tonight. I'm gonna catch y'all tomorrow. All right, so I know y'all been getting on me about my hair for a long time, but today we are actually getting it cut. Y'all know, ever since I became a cute, my hair, my hair has been growing all over the place, and I really haven't been, you know, trying to, you know, like even it out at all, or just been rocking like the crazy fro. But today I got Eric pulling up to the crib, and we are actually getting the hair chopped like evenly. You know what I'm saying? I wanted to have it grow up enough so. I could chop it down, it would still look cool because I want to have an afro, so I don't want to have no waves, I don't want to have no ball fade, you know what I'm saying? So I want to have enough hair at the end of the day, but today we're actually getting the hair chopped off. So as you can see, we picked it out, blew it out a little bit. As you can see, we low-key be having some like decent inches, you know what I'm saying? But it's just growing all over the place. It's uneven, shit short up here, long up here, all over the place. So we're about to go get that fixed right now. So I'm about to head out to finally get this shit chopped up. So let's do it.
I didn't expect that for sure. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Damn, that's gay. Oh, that's gay. That's gay. That's shit gay. Get her up out of there. Look at that. Hold on, bro. They don't have me fucked up, bro. Yeah, that just showed that they, it's comparable. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Obviously, she got a strap, so like, now y'all can she see how close it is to his. Right. I mean, the fact that she's hiding the fucking way yeah, in the NBA, exactly. like, they gonna start doing that shit more often. And then especially when, um, what's her name? Fucking get up, Kaylin? Yeah. Oh yeah, she's gonna be there for sure. Oh some. shit, nigga, I forgot she's in college. Yeah. Bro, <laughs> when you were talking about her, I was comparing the two of them, bro. I'm bringing her in college. The next day. Okay, so we got the cut. That's not really why I came to show y'all, but obviously y'all can see we got the cut. Uh, hair definitely is a lot shorter than before, but it definitely looks a lot more manageable because as y'all can see, this is all the length we have now. Before, it was a lot longer, but as y'all can see, it looked a lot more maintained, which I'm not mad at. Definitely lost a lot of length, but I'm not mad at that. Major, Major, come here. The point of this video is to show y'all that if y'all didn't know, I am now a dog dad. And if I, I am from a Jamaican household, you know what I'm saying, where we don't really have pets. And like y'all saw in the video in Jamaica, pets are normally outside. But now that I have a dog, uh, thanks to Cranon, now that I am a dog parent, you feel me? It's been a little different, obviously, you know, adjusting and everything like that. And kind of, it's really feeling like having a son, you know what I'm saying? But I'm going to show y'all, like, kind of the things I have to do to take care of him. Obviously, I got to go walk him in a second, but I'm not going to take y'all through the whole neighborhood because y'all need to see that. But I got to go get his food because he ran out of food. But I've never, like, actually gone to buy dog food before. I just wait till Cranon get it or I just order it, you know what I'm saying? So I'm about to go to the dog store and get some food. But for right now, I'm about to show y'all. Major, come here. Because he hasn't eaten yet today. I'm about to show y'all, you know what I'm saying? My son. <laughs> so, he loves these things right here. So, I'm about to give him some major. Come here. We got him. He's running over here. So, I gotta get some more food, but we're gonna do that later. Major, wait. Sit. Come here. Come here. Sit. He be listening sometimes. Sometimes when he want to listen. But it's what I be doing with him, you know what I'm saying? I, I hope y'all can see him. Shake. <laughs> Be gentle. Be gentle. There you go. There you go. There you go. So I'll be playing little games with him while we be right here. You know what I'm saying? So I'll be running. Come on. <laughs> I'll be running. Sit. Shake. And then I might toss him one. Be like, go get it. He missed it. He, 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 he athletic sometimes when he wanted me. You know what I'm saying? Sit. I'm gonna make sure you catch this one. So I get it on camera. See it? Get it. There it is. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna go get his dog food now. Um, I figure I really don't show y'all a lot of this part, you know what I'm saying? Because the fact that I am technically a dog dad now, and I don't really show y'all that much of it just because, like, not for a reason per se, but kind of just because, like, I don't know. I don't really be like shit really don't be happening. He just be here, you know? Cause Major's not like, this is the thing. He's not like a dog where he wants to be like have a house. Hey, hey! Sorry, you know what I'm saying? The dad had to come out of me. He's not a dog where he need like constant attention. You know how dogs be like all over the place, hella energetic and everything. Major literally just come in here, sit down. Now he being bad. Hold on. Major, come here! He's so bad sometimes, bro. But yeah, like I said, he's not a dog that be constant attention. You feel what I'm saying? He's not one of them type of dogs that be all over the place, running around and everything, just like tearing stuff up. Major literally come in here and he sit down and he don't move. And you go sit on the couch, he come sit beside you on the couch, and then he go to sleep. You like, you walk him two, three times a day and he good. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, he's a good dog. You feel me? But I'm going to go get his dog food now and kind of take after that process because that's new to me too. You feel me? So, let's get into it. And it's really unlike me to go through a whole video without giving y'all a cold start. You know what I'm saying? So, let's go ahead and do that. Okay then. Cranny don't be doing this, but I'll be leaving the balcony open for Major so he can actually like get outside while I'm gone. You know what I'm saying? I don't be the type to leave him cooped up in the crib. Granted, he may be like barking at dogs and stuff while we not here, but he a dog. I be letting him do what dogs do. You know what I'm saying? I just be letting him, let him live life. You know what I'm saying? So I should be leaving the balcony open for him so he can be out there running around and stuff. I would take him up to the roof, but he don't feel like going up all the stairs all the time. You know what I'm saying? But I'm about to go to the store now and get his dog food. I took a picture of it and everything, so I'll make sure I get the right one. And yeah, I got a couple more errands to run just because we are... I know we're going to Miami on Monday. And uh, 
I gotta get a couple things for that because we're gonna be in Miami for the whole week. So if y'all didn't know, we got Lift Miami going on this next coming week, this next weekend, whenever y'all seen this video. And if y'all in Miami, if y'all in the area, y'all need to pull up because y'all seen LA and LA was teed. So this one's gonna be even better. You feel me? So I'm gonna go get all this stuff now and then come back to the crib and probably end that video off there. But granted, this video not gonna be as long just because I gave y'all that little vlog throughout the midweek, you know what I'm saying? That would have obviously added to this video, made it another like 20 minutes, you know what I'm saying? But that's why a lot of people in the comments were saying like they liked you know the the midweek video just to kind of to throw in there you know what i'm saying because it was like they like it short to the point and they, they see what's going on it's really just simple like that but you know i low-key like the long videos i know y'all be waiting for sunday to see me you feel me and i've been taking a little break off instagram this week and everything's kind of just like living all, outside of social media but you know things been all right though things been all right but I just want to come talk to y'all real quick while I'm in the car and everything be warming up because y'all need to stop driving off with y'all cars the minute y'all turn them on. Y'all be training the car, put that bitch right and drive. No, you need to stop doing that. Let your car warm up. It's only like 50 degrees in Houston, even though it's like not freezing cold. Like when you drive a sports car or something like that, bro, you got to let your car warm up. It's not no Maxima. You know what I'm saying? It's not no Ultima. You can't just crank it and go. You know what I'm saying? And it's the daily. You got to have some longevity with this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, with that being said, <laughs> say it to the store. <laughs> Redford Nash Naturals. That's what we looking for. In here somewhere. This is my first time being in, in the actual store looking for food. There you go. Boom. Just like that. I think she said we should get beef this time though. So we might try this one. Okay. Hold on. I'm going to send her a picture though. I can be sure. But this one looking like the one. This is the one he on now, but I think this is the one he was on before and we switched from it because we it was like out of stock or something. But since it's here, we're going to go ahead and get this one. And it's about $54, so whole bag of dog food, $54, so honestly, I thought it was going to be worse than that. I ain't going to lie. And he be tearing these up, these little like bully braids right here. So I'm going to get him a couple of these too. Normally they got like the bigger ones, but that's all they got for today. So I think I'm going to grab him like two of these and that's going to be it. People be like, the C8 not practical. You can't do this as a daily driver because what you gonna what you gonna do when you gotta go place and stuff like that, bro? I got a whole thing of dog food. Boom, just like that. We're gonna set it right here. Boom, just like that. Throw that in there. Boom, just like that. Two talking about C8 not practical, bro. <laughs> like what, what are we what are we talking about right now, bro? I'm finna go on Walgreens, but I just realized and I was just thinking, bro, red box? Why is this shit still thing? <laughs> like, why is it still a thing, bro? Like, there's no way people still be going to a red box you know what i'm saying like there's no way people still be like buying physical movies i y'all just seen a report that said um best buy just took all physical movies off their shelf i'm like damn everybody moving to streaming like that's kind of crazy but i don't know i want to say that I'm, I'm about to go into uh, walgreens and get some like lotion and some old shit but i ain't about to take y'all in there because y'all really didn't see that but when i get back to the crib i'm gonna play with major a little bit more and we're gonna end this video off i might talk to y'all for a second and then we're gonna end the video off but yeah we're gonna go to walgreens and yeah bye so now that we're back in the garage, I feel like this would be a good time to tell y'all what we got going on with the car because we just so happened to be going out of town to Miami this week. So I figured we're going to be going for the entire week. It's a perfect time to get some stuff done to the car. So I know y'all seen the last video that we got all these boxes, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And excuse the echo because I ain't got my mic on right now, but we got all these boxes of things that we get done to the car. We got the, um, this is the rear diffusers for the back. We got the logo, the blackout logo on the front. We got the color change headlights right here. And we got some um, exhaust, uh, what's it called? Like the exhaust heat shield blackouts right here. You know what I'm saying? So all I'm saying is when we come back, the car is going to be completely different. And I don't want to tease it too much to tell what we got going on. I just want to let y'all know that by the time we come back, I'm dropping the car off tomorrow. I was supposed to do it on Saturday, but it would mess stuff up and I wouldn't have enough time for these leaving at one anyway. But we're supposed to drop the car from Saturday, but we're not dropping the car from Saturday anymore. We'll actually drop it off tomorrow. And when we come back, it's gonna be a completely different car. Obviously, it's gonna be another video. I'm gonna give it its own video once we get everything done. But I'm gonna hit to y'all. We changing that. We blacking it out. We got the exhaust coming in. We got the headlights coming in. I got the hood coming in. I'm telling y'all, it's about to be a whole different car when we come back from Miami. I'm excited to see what it's gonna look like because that shit gonna be tough. That shit is gonna be tough, man. But yeah, I just wanna let y'all know what we got going on before I throw everything, all this in the trunk uh, because I'm putting it in there now just so I don't forget about none of it. And so tomorrow, we ain't gotta worry about finding nothing while we trying to get, you know what I'm saying, what we got going on. Because we leaving our flight tomorrow at like two. 
And my mom, like, you get up in the morning, trying to do like an early morning workout and everything, get all the stuff out of the way. So I'm about to just put everything in here now. So tomorrow we ain't got nothing to worry about. You know what I'm saying? So boom, boom. Put that in there. Diffuser. Got the badges in there. You know what I'm saying? And we should be good, bro. I'm telling y'all, I'm so excited to see what this is about to turn out to look like because it's going to be tough, bro. It's going to be tough. I didn't, I didn't plan on doing it so soon, but because we're leaving and because we got so much time and I'm not going to be here, I figured I might as well do it right now. You know what I'm saying? I had a kind of a month without touching nothing, kept it real stop. So now it's time to really do something to the car. You know what I'm saying? So by the time we come back, I'm telling y'all, it's going to be a completely different car. Y'all just mark my words, bro. And I promise myself that every time we go out of town, every time we go do something and I'm not here, that's going to be the time we get something done to the car. That way we can pace things out because I know with the Mustang, I got a lot of stuff done like really quickly and to kind of mitigate that and kind of, you know, have the longevity of this car continue to be like, as along with the lifestyle that I'm trying to make it, we're going to continue to like do things little by little and pace it out. You feel me? But yeah, next, the next video after these Miami videos, when y'all see the car video come back, y'all ain't going to recognize saying, I'm telling y'all. Come on. Out with the old. Yeah, new. He been starving. I know you been hungry, bro. I know you been hungry, bro. It's okay. I got you. I got you. I'm here with the food. I'm here with the food. You know what I'm saying? Wait. Wait. Look how good he is, y'all. Wait. Wait. Sit. Sit. He don't like to eat when he got shit going on, but yeah. Finally got him some food, you know what I'm saying? The food ran out, so he been out here starving this morning, but I had to make sure I got it right, you know what I'm saying? But we made it back to the crib. I got him these right here, too. I got him these little bully sticks right here, too. I'm gonna put them up for later, though, because he don't know I got these. I'm gonna put them in there, so when he done eating, he can come. You know what I'm saying? Play with these, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, y'all. All right, I'm about to, uh, this is what I got for Walgreens. I literally, I don't even know why I'm throwing out this, because it really don't matter, but. This is the, the body wash I've been using right here, this Method Man. A lot of people got mixed reviews on what to say about it because apparently it's like bad for people's skin sometimes. But I haven't had no adverse reactions to it, so that's what I've been using. Y'all know we got that Dove Man Plus Care because got to keep that on us, you know what I'm saying? And then I've been using this CeraVe kind of face moisturizer. And then I got some new heads from my uh, toothbrush, you know what I'm saying? Because, huh, yeah, but yeah, man. It's really a chill day today, I ain't gonna lie. Cranny went to go get her hair done. Obviously, I can see I got the cut yesterday, you know what I'm saying? So we're really just getting ready to go to Miami. So everything really must be uh to be happening, everything really much going on, you know what I'm saying? I want to start editing this video, do some clown work and things like that, and then ain't no football no more because the Chiefs won last week, you know what I'm saying? So we ain't got no football to watch no more. So we're really about to just be kicking it, honestly. So yeah. I feel like I had more to tell y'all, but I honestly forgot. So we're gonna hit any video right here, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I said we got a good week, or like a long week coming ahead of us because we're about to be in Miami all week. So you know we're about to have hella vlogs next week, you know what I'm saying? Um, we got the event coming on that uh, next weekend. So we got two event days coming up, hella vlogs gonna be in Miami and everything. It's gonna be cool. We got shoots down there, all kind of stuff. It's gonna be good because it's gonna be good weather in Miami. Obviously, it's my Jemmy, you know what I'm saying? So what happens in my Jemmy stays in my Jemmy. I'm joking, bro, I gotta hold it. <laughs> but yeah, it's gonna be cool, it's gonna be cool, it's gonna be fun. And obviously, if y'all gonna be in Miami down there, y'all should definitely pull up and come check us out at the Gymshark event, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be cool, it's gonna be fun as always, but yeah, man. Oh uh, yeah, y'all let me know in the comments down below what y'all thought about this video right here. Kind of just a chill vlog because there ain't really much going on. But y'all, we got a good and eventful week coming ahead of us. So y'all definitely stay tuned for that. Make sure y'all like and subscribe to this video with a friend. And y'all stay swole, man. We'll see y'all on the next one. <laughs> Bye.